Welcome back, everyone, to another episode with your boy, Old Time Pokey. Just wanted to start this video out by saying thank you to each and every one of you, uh, especially uh, to a, a good select few that were really, really pushing uh, to make this guy the newest member <clears throat> of the 300 subscriber club. Um, I cannot express how joyous it has filled my heart. Um, means a lot. And I'm not going to get super emotional. It's not going to be like my live stream. <laughs> I promised myself I would not cry today during the opening. So, <laughs> we're going to get through all of the Tyranitar packs today, which I believe there should be enough for 12. If not, we'll just grab the next couple that are afterwards to find out. So, without further ado, <clears throat> let's get started. As you can see here, we have our remaining booster box. Um, and Tyranitar packs that we skipped over. We're going to open them first. Get them completely out of the way to see if my theory is correct or not. There's a code card for you guys. Four to the front. Let's get another code card. We have a fire energy. <clears throat> Let's see what it holds. Hope everyone is having a wonderful day. It is Saturday. Um, and as far as I can tell, it is a beautiful, beautiful day. We have a Octillery Holographic, which is always nice to have. Pack number two. Evolving Skies is practically here. Um, everyone can kind of taste it in their mouth. Uh, at least I can't. Uh, the EV Evolutions is in the air. And I am really looking forward to getting started on that set. Um, personally... I will be looking for any and all alternate arts and regular artworks of Umbreon for the missus. Um, she loves herself a good old Umbreon. Pack three. Uh, any evolution would do. I personally just really like the... Uh, the alternate art of Umbreon, where she's kind of standing over on the steps, telling all the pokies, like, yo, I got this. I got this. We have Darkness, our old friend. Speaking of Umbreon, Dark, let's go. Um, have seen many a people pull some really cool things out of the uh, build and battle kits. I myself last weekend was not able to participate in that. We have a reverse primate, which is always cool, and a phalanx non holographic. Um, I have a theory that Pokemon front loads a lot of the hit hits, like the major hits, uh, in the first couple products that get released. There's for. Trying to keep it in order, kind of, so that I can uh, kind of tell how many packs I've already opened. <laughs> uh, four to the front. Get you that extra code card. Um, we have Darkness again, our old friend. What can you bring? Uh, so I am looking, hopefully, to have a pretty good amount of product from the open. Um, or right off the rip so that, you know, that can hopefully carry over. We have an Aegis Slash Holographic. Not bad at all. Hollow Rare. Um, we have ran into non-Tyranitar packs. Non-Tyranitar. Okay, here we go. Here's a Tyranitar pack. 
We are up to pack five now. Um, and so far, Tyranitar packs are doing exactly what I figured they would do. Extra code card. We have fire. Okay, let's bring some fire for the peeps. Hopefully, to remind everyone, I am going for pretty much two cards. Um, the Mimikyu Full Art and the Rapid Strike VMAX Alternate Art Urshifu. Um, and we have a Corviknight V out of our fifth Tyranitar pack. Sounds about right as well. Gotta love Corviknight, as if you did not see from our first half, uh, we did pull these hits, um, recorded as hits. We have an Empoleon V, a Tyranitar V, a Tapu Koko V, and the Corviknight V Full Up, which is why I'm bringing this out, because we just pulled the regular Corviknight B. So I figured it would be a great time to do a little mini recap of what we pulled. Um, put those back off to the side. Get into our next pack, which we had to skip up a little bit. Okay, another Tyranitar. Let's see how many sets. Three, four, five. This will be pack six. Um, I wonder if there will even be enough Tyranitar packs to do 12, but we shall find out extra code card for you guys we have fire again let's see what's going to hold in this pack corfish a scatterbug a cubone murkrow a honage and a single strike urshifu v again Tyranitar packs doing pretty much what I expect them to do. Ooh, not a top loader, a sleeve. And unfortunately, we've pulled that guy far too many times. Uh, we are three six packs in. I'm going to take this quick moment um, to show you guys something. The people that truly are watching my content pretty much all the way through, or even if you kind of go back and forth. Uh, but I found something from my childhood that I thought was gone. Completely gone, never would see again. Um, and I figured it would be cool to show it with you guys. Uh, especially seeing as it is Pokemon related uh, and very old. Um, I'm going to scoop this booster box over just real quick out of frame so that I have enough frame. Uh, I'm going to go to full screen on my face real quick, um, but it is one of, and I'm going to, I found two things and I'm going to leave the second one to show you guys in a later video, um, but I thought I'd show you guys this. Um, keeping something like this, like I said, I thought this was gone, lost, gone, um, but my parents kept certain things um this is not a normal tin most people are like what is that i don't remember seeing that um but it's completely legit 100 percent um and i can show you guys on this screen now we're going to go to this screen as a full screen that this is a tv animation edition by Tops, an official Nintendo licensed product. If you guys see there, okay, the thing that I find the funniest about this is at the very bottom it says, Tops does not in any manner make any representation as to whether its cards will attain any future value. Well, Tops, you printed the right stuff. <laughs> so the value is definitely there. Um, <clears throat> super awesome there is nothing in it i don't have another like extra secret surprise for you guys uh, but my parents thought that it would be good to save certain things uh for sure save certain things and i just thought it was so cool um i brought those couple things home with me uh 
and I will definitely be keeping them in as as good condition as they were uh, back then and when we found them. So big shout out to uh, mom and pops. Love you guys. Uh, And now we are going to go back to the normal setup with the booster box like it was just a fade out, fade in, and we're going to continue. We are six packs deep. We're going to go for our seventh pack. We are looking for the next Tyranitar victim. Um, There's there. We're having to go kind of deep into the box. I don't think there's going to be 12 Tyranitar packs, which, again, if you ask me, I'm not going to complain about that. Code card for you guys. Let me get this extra code card. I'm going to give this as a scan for everybody. Hopefully the scan guys like that. We have a darkness energy. Let's see what this next Tyranitar pack holds for you, boy. Uh, Hopefully everyone enjoyed my last video. It was slightly quick, um, but with this, I just figured we'd get through everything. Kind of go from there. We have a Tapu Bulu reverse rare, which is always nice. And we do have a hit. I don't exactly know what it's going to be, but we do have a hit. We have a single strike Urshifu V alternate art, which is always nice to pull. Um, so close. <laughs> I have him already. So close. So close. But don't, please don't let this mug, this face fool you. I'm very happy. Another alternate art out of battle styles for your boy. Um, I can't really ask the pokey gods for much more. Uh, with battle styles, they have been very fruitful to me. And you know what? That came out of a Tyranitar pack. <laughs> you know, Pokeballer Mike said, watch, buddy. <laughs> You're going to pull your chase card out of a Tyranitar pack. And I pulled almost my chase card out of a Tyranitar pack. Oh, this is the world we live in. The pokey world we live in. Um, oh gosh, I don't even know. I don't even know. Wow, another one. To like DJ Khaled, another one, and another one. We've got Darkness Energy. How do we follow that up? By pulling the V Max alternate art. Never know. I didn't think that a regular V full art alternate art could be in the box after we pulled the full art yesterday, Uh, but I guess that's just how the cookie crumbled. We have our last, officially last Tyranitar pack, six, seven, eight, this is pack nine, so we have nine Tyranitar packs in the booster box. code card for you guys one two three four to the front i'm gonna give an extra code card we have fire (sighs) tyranitar what are you doing to me first off you're making my video a little bit longer than i wanted it to be (sighs) grandpa the grandpa reverse and a mind shell so we've got three packs to open for our 12 get through three of them right off the top not gonna go digging just gonna go forward to the front we have lightning cacturn energy exp share privilege esper ripbug silicobra houndor an octillery reverse and an electivire non-holographic empoleon what do you hold forgot to give a code card on that so my bad i will make sure that i give two 
right now. One and two. Um, we have Leaf, Darkness, Girder, Durant, Tepic, Honage, Electabuzz, Baltoy, Gligar, a Claydol Reverse Holographic Rare, and a Jellicent Non-Holographic. 10, 11, is this pack 12? Is this last pack, last pack magic? We shall have to see today. And let me do a quick count real quick. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12. This is last pack for potentially last pack magic. Four to the front, fighting energy. Real quick, let me give you guys an extra code card. And we're going to see how our last pack magic treats us. Spoink, Bronzor, Tepig, a Pachirisu, a Mindfu, a Ball Toy Reverse. It's kind of funny, we got the Clay Doll last time. And a Marowak Non Holographic. So quickly, just to recap, what we have pulled today, we have the Single Strike Urshifu V, a Corviknight V, and a Alternate Art Single Strike Urshifu V has been pulled out of this box that has also given us, in the first 12 packs, the Corviknight V Full Art. So, I would like to say, this box, as of this moment, is not a dud it is definitely a stud and at this point i really kind of want to find out what's in the last back third but we shall wait and until then as always from me to you we will see you next time